as days pass us by At most long for a place that too late to climb any Hello friends, my name is Shreyas Tiwari and today I will show you that how to make an automatic motion activated alcohol or soap dispenser at home by using just few components. For making this you will require a DC water pump, a aquarium tubing, few wires, a USB cable with a 5 to 12 volt adapter, a IR sensor or infrared sensor module, a TIP 32C PNP transistor, a 1 kilo ohm resistor and a plastic jar or container. First of all, these are the few components this, uh, through which we can make automatic hand sanitizer dispenser machine. Now I am showing you all the connections. This is my DC pump in water or sanitizer. This is the aquarium tubing and this is the pipe. This is the pipe through which I enter the sanitizer when the sanitizer is low or water. Mm -hmm. you, can, you can say anything. And this is the IR sensor module. This is our TIP 32C F1 transistor and this is our uh, 1 kilo ohm resistor and these are all the connections. This is my USB cable. This is my 5 volt adapter through which I have connect, uh, we have to connect. I, have, I am showing you to connecting like this. This will supply a charge only up to 5 volt as it is a 5 volt 2 way. 5 volt 2 way so now I am just showing you all the connections first we have to arrange or fix all the items in the bottles or this is our container in its cap first this TIP 32C transistor then our IR sensor and these are the two materials which we need to fix then we have to just make a small hole for uh, and uh, to just in, uh, and to just insert the DC water pump in the bottom of the container and uh, just a small hole to, in, to insert out the uh, pumps this is our pumps pipe aquarium tubing pumps pipe and this is my nozzle nozzle to dispense the sanitizers quantity I have fixed this that's why to re just reduce the quantity I have fixed this nozzle very easy connections first we have to place the DC pump and uh, by inserting the tubing also this is my tubing I have inserted uh, so this is the DC pump and this is tubing I have inserted we have to insert and place it in the bottom of the container then we have to take out the DC pumps wire this uh, DC pumps wire this, uh, this, this is my DC pumps wire these two red and black positive and negative and then we have to take out the DC pumps pipe this is my pipe so then when we take out first of all we have to connect this is our register we have to solder a wire to the base pin this is my transistor this pin is called base pin this pin is called emitter pin and this pin is called collector pin these are the three pins and in the sensor this is called output pin OUT out I think it is visible through camera this is GND pin and ground means negative pin and this is VCC means positive pin and this is the preset this is the preset through which we can uh, arrange the distance or we can maintain the distance through which distance we can get the sanitizer suppose I uh, I have twisted it to in its left side so I, I would able to get sanitizer by placing my hand in just front of this LED lights if I turn it on the right side through this distance I, I would get the sanitizer so this preset is just used for fixing the distance you have to keep it in the left side okay and so then now the connections are as follows first we have to take out the two uh, wires of the USB uh, of the pump first we have to connect the when well, first you have to sh solder just a wire normal wire to the register this is my 1 kilo ohm register you can also use up to 220 ohm register up to 220 ohm we can use and then we have to solder another wire in this point of the register and we have to connect it in the output pin this is the output pin OUT you can see output pin base uh, register to output I will also provide you the diagram through which I have uh, connected by seeing on the diagram only you can take the screenshot of the diagram at the end of the video I will show you this is the VCC pin you have to solder wire from VCC pin I have inserted the jumper wires here 
non soldering wires we call uh, from vcc pin to the emitter uh, collector pin this is the collector pin through which we have to insert this vcc pin this is vcc pin this yellow colored vcc and i have connected a wire another, another wire to the collector pin and we have to connect a wire from the emitter pin to the red uh, red color wire means positive wire of the pump this is the uh, wire orange wire you can see it is come from the it just came from the emitter pin this is the emitter pin emitter pin goes to the red wire of the gnd uh, or the pump not gnd of the pump this is red wire means positive wire of the pump and then this is our uh, then we have to fix the usb cable we have to take the usb cable and we have to solder one wire this is our uh, usb cable and we have to solder one wire to the gnd pin and one to of the vcc pin i have already soldered so these are the two connections now i am showing you i'm just take a test we, we have to just take a test of this machine so now i'm inserting thing it is not we just have to take a test so now i am switching on the lights when we switch on the lights this led starts glowing means it just signals us that your circuit or device is on and when i wave my hand in the front the another light starts glowing this is receiver we can call it as receiver as when i wave my hand just in front it will pump out the sanitizer you can see very easy it pumping automatically without touching without touching i can get the sanitizer you can see very easy connections these are now i am switching off the light these are my connections and through and through only this pipe we will enter the sanitizer when our sanitizer is very low so these are very easy connections i hope you all have understand and this is the box which i have made this is just like a automatic hand sanitizer dispenser machine i have prepared it with cardboard in the back side the flip pop system is there so if you like the video please press the please press the like button subscribe my channel we will fight against corona and we will win thank you Time is of the essence, the blood running through our core. It's best to not feel sorry when it's over. I will be the greatest that you've ever seen before, and I'll stay up there eternal.